Peters, uh, right, Andy Peters here has just watched Geordie Shores for the first time. Now, to give you a bit of uh, information about Andy, which you may not know, Andy doesn't like bad language uh, and uh, never swears, ever, <laughs> never, ever swears. And I've only been to Newcastle um, five times. He's only been to Newcastle five times. I don't think he saw the real Newcastle. If you are from Newcastle, you might argue that Geordie Shores isn't real, but whatever. Um, and he doesn't really like anything too lewd or crude. How we're friends, I've no idea. So let's find out with 500 people watching so far. What did Andy Peters make of Geordie Shores? Andy, what did you make of Geordie Shores that you just watched? I, 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 I'm flabbergasted. If I'm honest, I've never, I think I saw a bit of, of series. No, I've seen Jersey Shore. It's completely different. Yeah, I've seen it, isn't it? Just... What's a worldie? I've no idea. What was what, tashing, which means snogging, obviously. Tashing on. Tashing, uh, the the French Connection hut where they go for a little bit of. The, what do they call it? The French Connection hut. I wouldn't say that word. Right. Uh, I. It's unbelievable. Are people really? Let me just. Are people really like that? In. I mean, let's be honest. When I go to. Uh, <laughs> when I go to um, Newcastle. Like with the dance on ice tour. Do you go out on the riverside and all you want to do is bang? Bang them. I couldn't <laughs> believe it. The, the first time I ever went to Newcastle. It's like, it's like watching Geordie Shores with your dad. <laughs> oh, the, the, one of the times I went to Newcastle, the first time we did the dance on ice tour, my car pulled up and I kid you not, there was a fight going on in the street outside the car by the hotel. And there were girls who were wearing skirts that I can only describe as washing up gloves. And eating chips, watching the people fight, and just eating their chips. Who are you? Tell me some of your, tell me some of your impressions of some of the Geordie Shore people. Um, I think the girl. Do you know any of their names yet? Molly was Uncle Molly. No. Oh. Um, Vicky. Vicky. They all sound the same. I mean, obviously, because it's an accent. That's a, an accent. Let me just see uh, what people are saying. Chris. Don't worry about that. Don't worry about that. <laughs> Who's leathered? He says Chris is leathered. I'm not. I'm not drunk. I've not had a drink. He's not all had night. any alcohol. Thanks. I'm not drunk for two um, and a half weeks. Thank you. I think it's interesting that people would put themselves on telly like that. I've definitely tweeted one of them. What do you think of the guy with the comb over? Uh, <laughs> the one who he just managed to get into bed with a lady for the first time. Well, well that's that's not what he calls it though. What does he call it? Oh, I've forgotten already. I'm literally as it's going in, I'm wiping it on its way out. Um, what what did you make of the phrase? I wanted to look into the camera here. What did you make of the phrase, uh, balls deep in muff? <laughs> it's just... It's, it's, oh, MTV are hilarious. Um, but it, are you pleased that uh, he managed to, to end up banging a worldie? I'm very happy for the comb over boy yeah. that he managed to. I mean, he obviously goes to the gym, doesn't actually train hard enough. A um, little bit flabby, I felt. Uh, but you know, a, a bit flabby. He's a little bit flabby. He's, a, oh. he's that the one who called her a slag, Ricky. Yeah, he's probably the most in shape. But that other one, a little bit. Oh no! But Vicky's boyfriend's turned up at the door, who man. Looks, looks it's like all kicking Bra enough he now. He looks like Johnny Bravo. Are you? Are you? Now, do you want to see what's going to happen in the, in the next part of the show? It's half ten. I normally go to bed, but for the purposes of research, I will watch the next half an hour. Of Ge Geordie Shaw, and then shall we come back and do another the next a set of very events? quick? Yeah, exactly. Because I want to see what, what they use as the next week on Geordie Shaw. Because I'll be interested to see what delights I'll miss next Monday. What day is it today? I think next Wednesday. week. Next week they take it. They call the surgery and go to the clinic. <laughs> there must be full of diseases, all of them. And at no point was I mentioned of using a condom. Outrageously irresponsible MTV. Hey, you! Don't be silly. Get. Oh, God. Put a know. condom on that, Willie. Right, okay. Aye? Hey, thanks very much. Uh, right, so... Pajamas. Pajamas. Pajama uh, trousers. Um, so part two of Jersey Shore. Geordie. Oh, sorry. Geordie. Well, it's about to begin. Are we on, are we on a delay here? No. Okay. I'm on live. It's oh. a long ad break. I can't wait. It's unbelievable. Right, um, so we're going to go back and watch the next bit of Geordie Shores, and then Andy Peters here, uh, and I will be coming to... Well, I won't. Andy's going to ask him questions Just about it and find out what his favourite phrases are. Can I write down a few fake phrases that they yeah? use? Yeah, you want, yeah. Okay. Tashing on. <laughs> Balls deep in a worldie. <laughs> Such a wolf. Oh, right. bless them all. I think it's back on now, so here we, oh, go. Yeah, here we go. Geordie Shores. Why, I, man? Oh, you okay. 
See you in the next advert. See you in the next advert.